The main aims and objectives of the PDE Masterclass, I think, to give practitioners the knowledge and skills to be able to practice in the field of not only Parkinson's disease but in wider movement disorders. Well, there are really three main aims. The first is to try and develop professional confidence and awareness and uh, familiarity with some of the concepts lying behind the treatment of Parkinson's disease. Secondly, it's that they develop their own personal development such that they have a confidence that they know how to use other members of the team, they have the confidence in knowing that there are other members of the team out there and if they haven't already got them, how to best develop their service to, to, to get those people working with them. And then thirdly, there's the greater aspect of networking so that the people who have been through the academy know each other, they know the faculty, so that when they go to meetings, be they national or international meetings, they've got people they can talk to and feel confident about their own personal development. The Academy was set up because we recognised that the provision of services for patients with Parkinson's disease was very patchy throughout the country. There were examples of very good services and very good practice, but this was far from consistent and we wished to encourage the, the spread of good practice through all areas of the country so that patients could get access to the best services possible. The first masterclass of the Academy was held in September 2002 and since then we've had over 230 participants start the masterclass and just under 230 finish it. Half have set up a service and in about a quarter they've managed to negotiate for a Parkinson's disease nurse specialist to join them in that service. We've seen several major achievements at various levels, but if we talk about the first personal achievement, I think one would have to uh, point out Jane Liddell in Sheffield, who was one of our first uh, participants on the Masterclass, who then went on to win the Hospital Doctor of the Year in the Parkinson's disease category last year. And then again this year, we've had uh, one of the team members of the team that won in Derby had also been on one of the Masterclasses. By attending the Parkinson's Disease Academy, I've been enabled to broaden my own knowledge and skills of Parkinson's disease and its management. The Academy makes no assumptions about one's level of expertise, so it starts by teaching the basics and it takes it all the way up to cutting edge research and clinical practice. The intermodular audit works on a number of levels. The first thing is that it engages the participant in his or her local service, perhaps looking at the demographics of their area, seeing how many patients they should have on their patch. Then, looking at what's all already available and comparing and contrasting it with what should be available, again, gives them a very real feel for where they might go in terms of service development. It also works on the level that they bring back that audit to the wider group. So the 25 participants all share what they've done with everybody else. The best thing about attending the PD Masterclass was the networking opportunities and also the mentorship, which is um, an opportunity for a junior clinician to hook up with a senior clinician with expertise and knowledge of Parkinson's disease in order to develop one's interests and practice in that area. I've now become a faculty member on the Academy and I think that's a nice example of the Academy being able to foster someone's interest from the level of learner to the level of teacher. We rely very heavily on the mentors that we use between modules to help our participants develop their skills between the modules and as we go forward I think mentorship development is something that we need to look at and develop further. The role of Boehringer Ingelheim in the master classes has been exceptional. Um, they've worked uh, with us in partnership throughout. We've been extremely fortunate in the masterclass. We came up with an original idea which we discussed with people within the medical department at uh, Boehringer Ingelheim and subsequently been involved not only with the medical department but very much with the sales and marketing team but also people behind the scenes too, people with HR experience and IT experience who've been able to actually help us deliver the educational uh, goods. Boehringer Ingelheim have also been very generous in terms of lending us their expertise in mentorship development. Having Boehringer Ingelheim involved in the Academy has been exceptionally helpful to us. We wouldn't be able to run the Academy uh, in the way we do without the considerable uh, backing of, of Boehringer. The other uh, strand, I think, is the experience that Boehringer Ingelheim have been able to give us, with, particularly with respect to the mentorship programme. And there's a lot of interest in the tools that we've developed through the Masterclass with Boehringer Ingelheim's involvement and active support to try and improve services in our specialist area and it's now being looked at by the college as a way perhaps of improving other services in other specialist areas. 
The feedback we've had from participants has been exceptionally positive. Um, we've really been very pleased uh, over the years by the, the level of uh, satisfaction that's been expressed. Attending the masterclass will bring you into the community of Parkinson's disease. It will give you the knowledge, it will give you the confidence that you require if you wish to develop top quality services for your patients.